I've always was uh, interested in the mural of, in the past, for the past 20 years, it was always of interest. Then when I heard the project of building a new one and what they were doing about showing the past and also looking to the future, well, that was very of interest to me and I wanted to be involved to help make a difference. I've been interested in art for basically my whole life. So it's been really neat to help work on this with the rest of my classmates and also the members in the community. Um, I was one of the people who got to paint some of the, just the prime colors on it. But even that um, means a lot to me. I thought it was a real privilege to be able to be a part of the project. It was a Saturday morning, I think it was March, February maybe, and the panels uh, were all moved from the high school to the Hillrom factory and we started laying them out, it was like a puzzle. And Amy and Mary Kay saw it and they were both like, oh my gosh. And Amy said, that made the comment, she goes, I feel like I just gave birth. I think the mural is very important to Batesville because it shows the different things that go on in town, you know, the Eureka Band, uh, the different things of town, so it makes it very exciting for everyone to see. I got to paint the Gibson Theater, and that's where I used to work when I was a teenager, so that was a real thrill. This painting, this mural, it just goes to show all of the hard work that Mrs. Cameron and Mrs. McCabe put into their classes. Um, it was great. I was so glad to work on it. I'm very happy that I was a part of this. The mural is something that if you did not get to participate in, at least people should be able to get the opportunity to enjoy. I just hope that we have the people to come out and see the, the unveiling. I'm so excited about coming up there to see the unveiling of it, and I know it will just be dynamic.